the anatomy of the skull. In the adult, the skull consists of 22 individual bones. A suture is an immobile joint between adjacent bones of the skull. The narrow gap between the bones is filled with dense, fibrous connective tissue that unites these bones together. The long sutures located between the bones of the brain case are not straight, but instead follow irregular, tightly twisting paths. These twisting lines serve to tightly interlock the adjacent bones together, thus adding strength to the skull for brain protection. The two suture lines seen on top of the skull are the coronal and sagittal sutures. The coronal suture runs from side to side across the skull within the coronal plane. It joins the frontal bone to the right and left parietal bones. The sagittal suture extends posteriorly from the coronal suture running along the midline at the top of the skull in the sagittal plane. It unites the right and left parietal bones. On the posterior skull, the sagittal suture terminates by joining the lambdoidal suture. The lambdoidal suture extends downward and laterally to either side away from its junction with the sagittal suture. The lambdoidal suture joins the occipital bone to the right and left parietal bones and the temporal bones. This suture is named because it resembles the Greek letter lambda. The squamous suture is located on the lateral skull. It unites the squamous portion of the temporal bone with the parietal bone. Thank you for watching.